Well, I've always been somebody that questioned everything, and it really started when I was a teenager. I asked, why do we have to take the tetanus vaccine every 10 years? And just to shorten this for, for a time's sake is that I ended up finding out, asking all of my attending physicians, infectious disease experts, we found out that you know, the reason that they told us back then to take it was that when you are walking out in the yard, you have a rusty nail in your foot, the bacteria called tetanus gets in there, and then within minutes to hours, not days or weeks, you could spasm so terribly that you would suffocate to death and, and, and fall on the floor and die, like within minutes mm -hmm. to hours, which I've never heard of anyone dying that way. So come to find out that is a lie. No one has died that way. Nobody in the entire world in the history, I heard that. history, right? Yeah. So why are they giving it out if that's a lie, right? So I was doing an observation on my rotations in Detroit, Michigan, when I was training, and I saw that they gave some people the um, a vaccine for tetanus and some not as a protocol. And the ones that were on uh, welfare did not get it, but the ones who private pay did, which didn't make sense. But I saw there's a huge difference in fertility, huge. The people who didn't get it were extremely fertile. The people who did had a lot of problems. I Googled it then, and sure enough, you can still find this if you Google it, that the World Health Organization and NIH have since 1972 been developing the tetanus vaccine as an abortion or sterilization vaccine. They've been putting the pregnancy hormone inside the tetanus vaccine in that vial, and so Every time you get it, it's a cumulative response. Your body will then see, if you're female, you'll see oh, when you're getting pregnant, you have a higher and higher HCG level, right? Yep. Well, then your body will then learn to attack that. So it's going to attack an early pregnancy. So then you wouldn't even know you got pregnant in the first place. So they have absolutely used this in Latino countries, Africa, and India. I absolutely believe they were using it here in the U.S., although they deny Although you look on the World Health Organization websites, oh, they've had tons of vaccines they've been developing, they've been testing out, they've been utilizing on us for decades and lying to the doctors, lying to the other people. So my point is, these are the organizations standing behind the COVID shot right now. Mm -hmm.